Hey guys, what's up? My name is Pitcorn Nixon. Welcome to another Kingdoms of Alaric episode. In today's episode, we're gonna continue creating the forest and decorating the river. Hopefully, we will be able to add a few houses in the mountains or the forest. Make sure you smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and let's get started. So first of all, we will extend the forest by a lot. I hope to reach the other lake, at least on this side of the river. So the way I create this forest is with the help of world edit. I copied one tree design and then I just use this double slash paste command to paste it everywhere where I want to. In between the huge custom trees that I copy, I plant some saplings and eventually they grow into trees, creating a very dense and dark forest. In the end, I fly over the kingdom with a dark oak leaf brush that replaces only spruce leaves. With that, you can easily create some variety in your forest. To finish it off, I use a puzzle and gravel brush that replaces only grass blocks to give it a nice flooring. With that taken care of, we can move on decorating the river and the landscape around it. Now, world edit is great, don't get me wrong, but it actually creates a giant mess and so now we have to do the cleanup. I'm adding stairs and slabs, cobblestone and andesite into the walls, which totally changes the look of the landscape. To polish the design, you can add some leaves and grass blocks hanging from the sides of the ravine, maybe even adding some mossy cobblestone in between. Today's transformation took a long time and I had a busy week so I'll have to end this episode here. Nevertheless, I think that we did some huge changes to the landscape. I hope you enjoyed this style of video that is a bit more tutorial based. Thanks for watching and see you in the next. Bye for now.